Michelle Andes is the mother of an active four-year-old boy with another little boy on the way. This former collegiate softball player has always had issues with her ankles, and then in 2010. I ended up playing volleyball, which is volleyball on a racquetball court. Had a really bad ankle sprain, tore all the ligaments on the outside of my ankle. Michelle had traditional surgery, but it didn't work for someone so active. And it turned out that I couldn't run, I, my ankle would swell between trying to work out, do other things, I just couldn't handle the pain or the swelling. So Michelle came to see Dr. John Campbell at Mercy Medical Center's Institute for Foot and Ankle Reconstruction. He suggested a relatively new procedure involving something called biocartilage extracellular matrix. In layman's terms, that is a pro commercially available prepared cartilage material from cadavers. And it's almost like a powder. And what we typically do is we mix that with some of the patient's own bone cells and bone marrow stem cells, which is a new technique, and to try to use the patient's own cells to use this as a graft, almost like a, like a putty. Dr. Campbell says this procedure is less invasive, but the recovery can still take a while, up to six months to get back to full strength and mobility. Michelle says it wasn't easy, but definitely worth it, especially with a new addition on the way. We're just, in general, a very go, go, go family. Um, we're always at the park, we're always going to a ball game, um, so it'll be nice to actually be able to do versus kind of stand there and watch. Mindy Becerra, WBAL, TV 11 News.